Hi everyone, here we are going to solve 8 times 9 times 10 times 11 times 12 equals what? So what are we going to do is just convert all in terms of the base 10. So let's see, what is 8 in terms of 10? That is 10 minus 2 times you have 9 as 10 minus 1 and this is 10 so I'm going to keep it then 11 can be 10 plus 1 and 12 is 10 plus 2 now what are we going to do is let 10 is equal to x x is equal to 10 so here we're going to substitute x in place of 10 so we have x minus 2 times x minus 1 8 times x and then x plus 1 and x plus 2 the easiest way to solve the problem so let's do it now just rearrange the terms x I'm going to keep it here then I have x minus 2 and x plus 2 then I have x minus 1 and then x plus 1 now if you see this is an identity a plus b times a minus b and this as well so that's a square minus b square so x times x square minus 2 square and this is x square minus 1 square now what are we going to get x times x square minus 4 and this is x square minus 1 let's multiply them together using the foil method we have x then we have x square times x square x to the power of 4 x square minus 1 minus x square minus 4 times x square minus 4 x square and then minus 4 minus 1 is plus 4 let's see we can just add them up x times x to the power of 4 minus 5 x square plus 4 so we've got a equation here and as we already know that x is equal to 10 yes so let's put it back 10 then 10 to the power of 4 minus 5 times 10 squared plus 4 now 10 times this is 1 0 0 0 0 minus 10 10 square is 100 so 100 times 5 is 500 plus 4 and that's so easy to calculate you have this let's add them up 0, 0, 0, 4 minus 500 so you have 10,004 minus 500 how much is 10,004 minus 500 just subtract so you have 9,504 times 10 will give you 95,040 and that's your answer how simple was that bye bye take care